Future earthquakes could trigger much larger tsunami. Haiti is surrounded by a complex jigsaw of tectonic plates. And just off the northeast coast of the island is a second and potentially much more deadly fault. This is the main junction between the North American and Caribbean plates. We have the Caribbean plate, we have the American plate, the American plate is pushing down underneath it and it's causing the Caribbean plate to, to bend like this. Now what can happen is that the plate pings back upwards, uh, producing a big earthquake and also transmitting energy into the, into the ocean and generating a big tsunami. That's what we saw in Sumatra in 2004 in the Indian Ocean. The Boxing Day tsunami of 2004 began with a massive magnitude 9.2 earthquake off the coast of Sumatra. The third biggest earthquake on record, it occurred when a huge section of the Earth's crust rebounded, displacing billions of tons of seawater in all directions. The tsunami charged across the Indian Ocean. As it reached land, it washed away buildings, cars, and anyone that stood in its path. It killed over 230,000 people in 18 different countries. The large subduction fault lying off the northeast coast of Haiti has the potential to violently rupture in the same way, generating an immense magnitude 9 earthquake. If there is one of these big subduction zone earthquakes, then it will rupture um, a length of fault which may be as long as a thousand kilometers. It would create a gigantic wave, traveling at the speed of a jumbo jet. Within 20 minutes, it would hit the coast of the Dominican Republic and then deluge Haiti and the rest of the Caribbean. After an hour, it would flood South America, Florida, then swamp the Gulf Coast. Within seven hours, the tsunami would travel over 4,000 miles across the Atlantic to crash on the beaches of Africa and Western Europe. This nightmare scenario could be imminent. The geological record has revealed that Haiti's subduction fault has not ruptured for a thousand years. But even though many geologists are convinced that this event will happen, they cannot exactly say when. These reports should not be dismissed as scaremongering. 